Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I made this charcuterie spread for one of my best friends. This is going to be for her bridal party and we are going to be munching on this while we are getting ready for the day. First, I'm going to be laying out the manchego cheese and I'm trying out this new design that I've never done before and I really like it because it gives it a more 3D effect and it just looks so cool. It's easy to grab and take a piece to eat with some meat and crackers as well. Next, I'm just placing down some Gouda cheese. So I cubed up a whole brick of Gouda and I just cut it into bite-sized pieces. And this has a really nice smoky flavor and it's paired really, really well with fruits, especially grapes. That's my favorite. Next, we're working on the salami train and I'm just using Italian dry salami for this board and I'm just folding it into fours and just placing it all over the board and I just like to arrange it up against the cheese just so it stands up nicely. Now we can start adding all of the fruits. I like to start with the grapes and I just like to put little bunches all over and arrange them nicely. Next, I just cut up a whole bunch of strawberries and I like to place them all over as well so that everyone can get some meat and fruit and cheese, a perfect balanced bite. Now I'm just adding a whole bunch of cut up sweet mini bell peppers and mini Persian cucumbers. These were a really good hit and they really go well with hummus or any type of dip. I always like to garnish the top of the cheese with some type of fruit and so I'm layering some blueberries on top of this truffle brie, which was so good by the way from Trader Joe's. And you guys know how I love to garnish with fresh herbs. So here I'm just placing a whole bunch of sage all over and it really adds a nice color to the board and texture as well and it smells amazing. My best friend, the bride, loves pickles, so I had to make sure I included an entire jar of mini pickles for her, and these were gone in seconds. Now I'm just putting down some jalapeno artichoke dip for the sweet mini bell peppers and the cucumbers, and this was such a good combination. Highly recommend. Now that the actual charcuterie is complete, I'm going to go ahead and add in two bunches of fresh eucalyptus and I love to outline my whole entire charcuterie board because it just looks and smells amazing. It just takes it up a notch, it looks so elegant. And here's the completed board and I just finished it off with some white roses to match the bridesmaids bouquets and everyone loved it. It was such a great hit, so easy to snack on when you're getting ready for your big day. Highly, highly recommend doing this for your bridal party. It was so much fun.